Hey, so Helium 10 vs Sellerboard. Sellerboard or Helium 10, which one is right for you? Which one do you need? Which one is right for your business? Which one is the right investment for you? In this video, I'm gonna break it down for you because I've been a user of Helium 10 since 2017. I'm still an active user. And I've been a user of Sellerboard since about 2019-ish, 2020-ish, and I'm still actively using the tool. So I have experience and I wanna share my real experience with you so you'll be able to make the best purchase and investment decision for yourself. In the description of this video, you are going to find special free trials for both Helium 10 and Sellerboard, special links, check them out. And you're going to find special discounts. So there's going to be a discount of Vova 50, grants you 50% off your first month on Helium 10. And Vova 10 grants you 10% off every month recurring on Helium 10. These are good for the monthly and the yearly plans of Helium 10. They're good for the Platinum, Diamond and a la carte plans. On the other hand, for Sellerboard, you're going to have a special link that grants you two free months of usage for any plan. So even if you're a smaller seller, a bigger seller, you can Try it out, play with it, see if you like it or not. It's great to meet you. My name is Volva. I'm a seller on Amazon. Been selling there actively since 2016. And I'm still active in the trenches of Amazon US and Canada, going strong. And I'm helping you here on YouTube. I have over 320 videos at this point, and we're not stopping. So Helium 10 vs Sellerboard. What's up here? Which one is good for whom? And why am I using both of them now? <laughs> I'll explain. So first, Helium 10. Look, it has most of the tools that an Amazon seller would need. Probably almost all of them. Yeah, really. Because they just have everything almost inside the suite of tools of Helium. 10, even a playlist of Helium 10 up here and in the description that has over 80 tutorials, 80, 80 of Helium 10 shows you pretty much how to use most of the parts of it. Helium 10 is going to be good for product research, keyword research, listing optimization, market research, keyword tracking. They have a free course that comes with Helium 10. There's an extension that helps you with product research and product validation. A lot of stuff, great support and whatnot. They have a huge Facebook group. I'm still an active user of Helium 10 and I like it. So you're like, why do you use Sellerboard? Like, what's the idea? Well, Sellerboard, it's a profit analytic tool. It helps you calculate your profits on Amazon. Just shows you what you're earning. And it has a really nice system to calculate all of this and show you your real profits on Amazon. It also has other things like inventory management. They have a review requester that can get you money back. I'll tell you right now that everything pretty much that Sellerboard has, Helium 10 also has. But honestly, me and my partner, we found that Sellerboard is better for us in the profit calculation part. We've also used Helium 10 for profit calculation. In fact, beforehand in 2017, let's say, we started the journey of our usage of tools with Jungle Scout Fetcher. Fetcher was the tool that we've used for Profit Analytics. Then we switched to Helium 10, I believe, Profits. And then we've switched to Sellerboard Profits to try it out first. And we have really fallen in love with a Sellerboard Profit Analytic tool. And we're using Sellerboard to work with the profits. We're calculating the profits there. I'm still using Helium 10 for product research, for product validation, for keyword research, listing optimization. I use the market tracker of Helium 10 and whatnot. However, for profits, I found Sellerboard to be more accurate. I'll tell you another thing that price-wise, Helium 10 is a bit more expensive. So if you want to use only the profits part of Helium 10, it's going to be about $39 for you with the starter plan. So the starter plan of Helium 10 inside has the uh, profits tool by Helium 10. It's about $39 a month. And it also has the Chrome extension as well as the Freedom Ticket course by Kevin King. Some other parts, but that's the main part of the starter plan. It's $39 a month now. And there are no discounts for the starter plan. Seller board starts at $19.90, I think about $20, $19.95, something like that. $90 something per month. So it's a bit more cheap than Helium 10. All right. And there are different plans. The bigger you are as a seller, the more you're going to pay for seller board. But for a beginner, if you only need profit analytics, I think if you only need profit analytics, nothing else, maybe inventory management as well and money back and review requests. And there's a bunch of stuff that seller board does aside of profit analytics, then use seller board. If you need product research, you would research listing optimization, free course to understand how to start selling on Amazon, Chrome extension for product validation, go with Helium 10, in my opinion. For most of the big Beginners, Sellerboard is not a tool that will help you find your product or something like that. It's more for those who are already selling. They need Profit Analytics tool. Or even for beginners who want to get parts of Sellerboard, 
then you can still use it like the money back feature and stuff like that but for a beginner who's like looking for products and trying to understand amazon business there's also a free course so go with helium 10 in my opinion if you are somebody that's looking for accurate profit analytics and you want to try it vs other tools try seller board there are going to be links for both of them that grant you free trials for both helium 10 and both seller board the cool thing about the seller board free trial that i can offer you through the link it's not one month it's two months so sometimes a month is nice but two months gives you more time to understand to play with the tools so i do recommend you checking them out it's affiliate links means that if you ever invest in helium 10 or seller board i'm gonna get a little commission from that at no extra cost to you so go check out the links and see which one is the best for you again both of the tools deliver but they are just for different things again if you want to be a beginner seller and have like product research keyword research and all this then helium 10 if you need profit analytics, like inventory management, then seller board. And even though Helium 10 has all of these, I would encourage you to try and see if it's just more accurate for you. If you find it more comfortable to work with, there's also this part. And for now, for me, for profit, it's seller board. Helium 10, I use for most of the other things. Now here on the screen, I'm gonna leave you the playlist of Helium 10 that has all of my tutorials of Helium 10, over 80. And there's gonna be also a tutorials playlist of seller board that has about six videos, I think. But it's growing <laughs> I'm, I'm learning it too and i have more stuff to share with you so check them out all the discounts and all the good stuff is in the description are in the description and have a great day thank you